All right, I'm going to go offense for this next one. And it's one that's kind of been floated around and people are paying attention to who's following who on social media because it's that time of year where that apparently means something. Uh, Saquon Barkley to Houston, man, would be so fun. So fun. Um, in terms of what Devin Singletary and Damian Pierce did last year, I think Saquon is obviously a step above those two guys. Um, putting him in an offense with CJ Stroud and Tank Dell and Nico Collins, Dalton Schultz at tight end. The offensive line for Houston, like when healthy, is quite good. Um, I, I would love this pairing. And I think that, you know, in terms of having Houston go from, you know, that really good wild card team that can win a playoff game, but they still need something to go to that next level. Saquon Barkley could be that guy. They still need to get um, help on defense because Steven Nelson is a free agent at cornerback. They need somebody else to put opposite of Derek Stingley. They'd probably like to get another Ed Rusher. Is Jonathan Grenard a free agent this year? I feel like he is. He's a free agent. So they've got some holes to fill on that side of the ball. Still not perfect on defense, but man alive. Give me Saquon in that offense. I think it would be very similar you know, in terms of what he does for them to what CMC did for the 49ers in terms of just making them that much better. So I actually had a very fun Saquon fit that I don't think will happen, but this okay. team absolutely would make that uh, signing, and it is the Los Angeles Rams. Oh, I, man, I, you were in on them getting Jonathan Taylor last year, I remember. I think the Rams would be so much fun with Saquon Barkley. Kyron Williams is fun. He is yeah. a fine back. You add Saquon Barkley to that offense, you add an instant burst of electricity. You add a legitimate home run threat every time he touches the ball, and you can kind of live with Cooper Cup and Puka Nakua being the kind of the mid-range game yeah. and let Saquon be the home run threat. And you let Kyron Williams not be able to take as many hits. Ronnie Rivers is not it, and you can let him be the third back. But having a, a one-two punch of Saquon and Kyron Williams, incredibly fun. Do you think that Derrick Henry would work in Los Angeles? I potentially. I feel I like quietly that would be very cool. Because I think it would be cool. Yeah, I agree. I think the people linking Derrick Henry to Philly, Derrick Henry would not be good in Philly because Philly is not an under center team. Mm. Philly does not run the ball from under center. Derrick Henry is an under center running back. And I think where LA has kind of shifted, instead of being predominantly outside zone, which Derrick Henry is still very good at, they've gone to more gap runs and duo. Mm. They're running at you downhill. You know who's the best downhill runner in football? <laughs> the 6'3", 250-pound guy in Tennessee. That would be a lot of fun. I kind of want to see it just very, like, selfishly. Like, give give that offense some more punch. Mm -hmm. Like, let, let's see how far they can really go.